Adventures of Allie and Clint. All right, y'all. So I'm going to try to cram quite a few things in this video that I'm about to do. Um, this was sent to me by an Amazon affiliate to uh, help me with my, my bank fishing. So if y'all watch my videos, um, I, I just don't target one thing. I just don't target the bank or the boat. I, I, I target bank, boat, and trot line. I, I, whatever means necessary. Passionate about it. So an Amazon affiliate sent me this for my bank fishing. This is a, I want to, in the background, you can see, let me move this. This is what I have to carry by myself at three o'clock in the morning when I go fishing. I have to carry two, that's another in the bag, I have to carry two six foot extension lights that bag that's a backpack that weighs about 40 pounds full of tackle that's a gopro bag and that's three 12 foot rods and i have to carry that by myself every time i go down and make a video sometimes i gotta make two, two trips and it's three eighths of a mile to where i bank fish from so it's a very long walk it's very a lot of stuff that's heavy Stop and take a break, catch your breath, put it down, come back up the hill, get the rest of it, go back. It takes 45 minutes from the time I get in the parking lot till I cast the first pole out by the time I get it all down there and get set up. So, like I said, an Amazon affiliate sent me this, and I'll put a link in the description of this video to get one of these if you want one. You can use it for multiple uses for whatever you want. But for me, it's probably going to be perfect. So, I haven't unboxed it i haven't tried it to see if it all fit none of it i didn't want to unbox it and then put it all in there and show y'all i wanted to, let's all do it together so we're going to see right now what this is is this is this is a, a utility cart and this is the best one on the market there's plenty of them out there that are 120 80 this card is expensive but this card didn't cost me nothing but this is an expensive cart it's 222 dollars but when you compare it to all the other ones you see on there, you'll see why it costs $222. But let's unbox it and check it out. Box is heavy on it. It's heavy too. I saw another guy on YouTube do a review on this same cart. But he tried to do it with just his phone in his hand. But he really liked it. So we're going to find out right now. And then we're going to put it and see if everything will fit in it. Well, it's going to take two days to get it un untaped. Well, it's got a lot of tape on it. But we're going to see. And hopefully, this will solve all my problems. I wanted to go fishing today. It was go fishing today or make this video for you guys and for me and unbox this thing. So here we go. I'm going to bring the box over there and show you the name of the company because I can't figure out how to say it. It's X-Y-A-R-T Outdoors. You might say that's Yart, Zart, however you want to say it. But that is the name of the company. You could order it probably from their own website or you could order it from Amazon. However you want. We're going to see. My buddy's got one of these. Shout out Justin from the streets. And uh, here's the first one I seen use one. So I had to have one too. All right, it's got straps down here that holds the top on. And my wife gave me, before I can't get it too far into that, my wife gave me a great idea. Y'all will see me at the catfish conference this year in Louisville, Kentucky. And you'll see my two little rug rats. And I'll be dragging them around in that green wagon. So when you see me, if you're there, hey, tell me you saw me on the, this video and you saw this wagon. All right, so it's got a little cover that straps on the top of it. And it has the insert inside the cover with a handle. So we're going to pull the handle off and we're going to lay it aside. We're going to lay the bottom. I'm assuming that's the bottom piece. We're going to lay that aside. It's got another Velcro strap right here. Man, this thing is heavy duty made, guys, and I am not exaggerating. All right. We got that strap off. All right, here we go. Push down on the bottom. 
Bottoms down. Retractable handle. Oh man, I like that. Hope y'all can see that good. We're gonna put the bottom in it. The bottom is in it. All right, there's the wagon itself. All right, we're gonna put this back in the bag. As soon as I can figure out how to shut it. I use it all the time. It's my light and I can't figure out how to shut it. Well, it's hung up for some reason. Anyway, I'll worry, I'll worry about that later. So we'll just pretend it's in the bag. bag that's got to go in it and it fits absolutely all the way in there here we go there's a the tackle bag and it fits all the way in there GoPro bag it fits all the way in there now if I had to stop right there and give up I would say I could carry these rods with one hand and pull the cart with the other hand but that's, I'm going to say that's a f almost four foot cart because that's a 12 foot rod broke down. And there ain't much of it left sticking out of there. And I'm telling you guys, it's even got locks on the front wheels. That right there is a game changer for me. If you're a bank fisherman and you got a long haul, hey, this is the one. It's got... It's got the biggest wheels of any cart out there. It rolls smooth. It's heavy duty. It is what I needed. <sighs> Love it. Shout out, Yart. Good looking out. I appreciate the support. And like I said, guys, I'm going to put a link in here for this. Now, while we're talking about this, people have lots of questions for me. Uh, can we see your boat? What kind of poles do you use? I'm just going to give you a quick rundown of everything I use. But first, I'm going to show you what I got in the mail today. This is for one of the, this is for a trot line, and I'll probably get two more. I'll probably get two more for one for my wife, and one for me when we're bank fishing. But this is for the boat. These are from Randy at MinotaurHooks.com. I'll leave a link in the description. Use the code, the promo code, catfish25, and you will save 25% on all tackle. Their stuff is su superior. It's great. Go snatch something. So, these are my rags. And these are bad out. Everything I get is, I try to get is green. Hey, I'll have one clipped on the front of the boat for Allie, one clip on the back of the boat for me. Then I'll get one for my tackle bag when I'm down at the, on the bank side. Got it all. Love it. Awesome. Minotaurhooks.com. Now, on my poles, I got Andy Monster 50-pound monofilament. Five-ounce no-roll sinkers. Minotaur showstopper 10-ounce hooks. Minotaur green sinker beads and that pretty much and th those are those are okuma longitude 12 foot surf rods with Daiwa s x h a 50 series conventional reels all right now so i showed y'all that i'm gonna take the phone off here hey be on the lookout for the new gopro 10 i got too we upgraded from the GoPro Hero 2018. We got the GoPro 10 now with the little mountain lights on it. And upgrades, baby, upgrades. So, people want to see the boat. We used to fish out of the mud cat. Trot lining and pole fishing. We ain't got the mud cat no more. We upgraded two feet to the swamp donkey. The motor's covered up with a trash bag because I just like to keep my motor covered up. That was a Mercury 4 horsepower. Steve Douglas Monster Rod Holders. Fabricated rack. 
And there's 14 foot of swamp donkey right there. There it is. When I got this boat, shout out Waylon Thompson. A buddy of mine got this for me as a gift. It didn't have this deck. I built that deck. It didn't have compartments. I built compartments front and back. It didn't have a floor. It's got a floor now. Had none of this, just open area. Built the storage compartment for the life jackets. It's got, I made, I fabricated and made these trot line swirls. So when you're running the motor, you tie off one side of your trot line while you're driving, you're just unrolling. Got one on each side. We're allowed 33 hooks in Missouri on our trot line. So my wife has a fishing license and I have one. That's 66 hooks in the water at one time. People ask me about my weight. Hey, ain't nothing but a ball off of a truck. Receiver ball with a ring welded on it. Three, one in the front of the line as soon as you put it in the water, one in the middle, one on the end. I'll probably run 150 foot of trot line on each one. Uh, that is my bait catcher right there. Can't remember where I got it from, but it's a good one. Back here is my trot line bucket. If I take the top of that bucket off, there's, th there's 66 hooks wrapped around there. All soon to be Minotaur showstoppers and bigger. The Big Sue is the other one that I can't wait to get my hands on. I like big hooks. No room for error. Bet's eight foot cast net. Big dip net. If you watch one of my videos, my wife, she gets on my old dip net. And she, she goes to dip a hook, a, pick up a 50. And when she hooks that 50 and picks up on it, it just folds the net over. So we had to get rid of that one and get a new one. Oh, I got to show y'all my anchor since we're here. My father-in-law one day, he actually, I got a bunch of weights for you for working out. And I got just a spot for them to bring them to me. So another custom clink cotton fabrication right here. There's his weights. That is probably one of those things where... 10, 10, uh, let's see, what's that say? Six, six, and four. There you go. 16 pound anchor. We ain't going nowhere. People ask me where I fish. In the water, with a hook, and with bait. I probably shouldn't tell this because last time I told this, I caught a big catfish and I was on the news in my local area. When that news, when that news clip aired, uh, people started showing up to my spot. And then three weeks later, I caught a big fish. They did another story and more people started showing up and then i caught a bunch more big fish and they did one more story i can't hardly go to my spot no more but it's a it's a conservation area it's for everybody it ain't just for me it doesn't matter if there's 200 people there and now i'm not bragging what well, maybe i'm bragging a little bit but i'm really not bragging but me and my wife go back to the same spot every time we've been here for the last four years doesn't matter if there's 100 people out there. We have this one little spot that we go to. And there will be people coming from the left of us up the creek. People from the right come up the creek. And they're like, you didn't, we didn't catch nothing. And we'll have a whole boat full of fish. It's just something about this spot the Lord blessed us with that my wife found. I didn't even find this spot. My wife said, that's where we should put our trot line. And I was like, no, nah, that ain't going to work. And we did. And we killed them there our first year here we caught a thousand pounds of catfish in six weeks and that's not a false story that's absolutely true second year we caught 750 third year we caught 850 so i'm just i'm excited to see what this year brings i am ready to fast forward through through uh winter and get on to spring so there's the cart y'all let me get up closer for y'all there it is if you need bank fishing mobility, that's that's the cart for you. I'm telling you, I love it. Um, Minotaurhooks.com. Get your hooks there. Save 25%. Good hooks. Big hooks. And I think that I probably just about covered everything. Hey. Adventures Alley and Clint. Y'all stay tuned for the action.